Welcome back, Metal Cat Travelers. We are doing the King of Nevermore Part 3, and I'm with Silver today. Hey. And I did change my team a little bit, guys. Um, I actually gave Claude a Pursing Zone, so he might, you know, do something a bit better. I was trying to get Ismena on uh, some uh, Water Bangle, Water Bracer, and I uh, realized that I need to farm stuff, so... I just brought uh, Flamelopus. You did last time, and that didn't work, so I predict a disaster. Oh, why didn't it work last time? Uh, you died because the monster kept healing. Oh, right, 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 because... Yeah. Yeah, it was a huge problem. Yeah. Had, like five times Yeah, no, no, I remember, I remember. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it should, be, it should be better now because I'm gonna do Pursing Zone. So, yeah. So once again, guys, no preparation. We're going in this blind. Because that worked so well last time. Hey, it did, right? It did, right? It did. Okay. <laughs> it did. I mean, I, I think it did. Um, I mean, you know, I had fun. Um, yeah. Yeah, I had fun. All right. I suppose that's all that matters. Yeah. So, uh, so uh, while I get there, I, I was talking with uh, some um, other um, people from the other Eden community, and uh, they all they all agreed that um, my voice my voice for Claude was perfect. Oh, good. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm glad you yeah. hear it. Yeah, yeah. We, we were talking about. It, I'm like, like, no, I kind of like made Claude kind of like a theater student who just learned about Shakespeare, and they're like, yeah, no, it's it's awesome. I'm like, all right, and then I send it a little link to my video, and they liked it. So, all right, guys, let's see if I'm gonna do it properly. Also, did some trial yesterday. Awesome. Yeah, it didn't suck. Good for you. All right, we're at it, guys. So, I remember this guy being a giant asshole, right? It was, uh, he was problematic at best. Yeah. Um, all right, so. Oh, I think the bar is gonna do There it. you go. I should have put Neptune in the metal, but whatever. There you go. See? Done. Yeah, well, that's the whole trick, right? You needed to one-shot him. Otherwise, yeah. that wasn't gonna be... Uh... Yeah, there's a, yeah, there's a couple of characters in a trial that you need to do, like, crazy amount of damage. So, yeah. All right. Let's keep on going. So, guys, obviously, I'll be doing the male character. So, we're gonna be doing the woman's character. Except for the king. I'm also the Except king. Except for the king, and sometimes I'm the old people. It's kind of a whatever. Disturbers of Kel Kel fought. Overcome the red tooth circle. Oh, okay. Alright, let me uh, let me go here. Trash mob still do damage. Be she sounds like you. Trash mob mm -hmm. also do damage. Take that. Oh. Oh, okay. I cannot go. <laughs> Flamelopis does not go brrrr today. Ooh. Ooh no. I can't wait for nobody to say that anymore. I think it was it's definitely a, a downgrade for the uh, the reverse of a glow up for the English language. God damn there. it. <laughs> God damn it. Oh. <laughs> Alright, Flamelopis is not is not my 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 one I mean she's my one trick pony. So Flamilipus is not good, so what's her- oh, okay, so, so, so they're weak to fire, alright. Alright, they're weak to fire. Yikes! Alright, they're weak to fire. So I'm just gonna switch my team a little bit, guys, you know. Was my dream I'm, um, just you know, those were just mobs, right? Yeah. Hmm. Alright, they're fire. So I'm gonna switch my team a little bit, guys, all right? Why don't you just switch it entirely and put all the OP characters? My OP characters get decimated because they're weak to food, because they, ice is, uh, because ice is, is strong against them. So weak. Oh, you're calling me so weak? <laughs> you're calling me so weak? I'm still gonna keep Claude in the party, just because. And you know what? I'm gonna put, uh, I'm gonna put a couple of characters that I haven't put. There you go, Uzuki, Garyu, Aisha, and Claude. And Aisha's gonna have a fire zone on her, there you go. See? See? A bunch of uh, person characters and Garyu. You you will love Garyu, by the way. It's all, uh, it's all quest. I mean, I did it like way back, but his whole purpose yeah, is... Yeah, I remember. He just wants to be strong. So like he keeps fighting like stronger monster until he fight. He fights like the god of fire. 
And well, like, if he's a motivated guy yeah, like Claude, I'm sure I'll more, love him. More than Claude, he's also a little bit dumb. I don't think it's possible for anyone to be more motivated than Claude. Claude has the absolute conviction, um, the, the absolute courage of his opinions at all times. Oh, you know, Garillo also. And because I, and because of that, I find him very relatable. Although I don't think I'm a king in a distant land, I can still feel him because whatever I do, I do it with the same type of energy, right? Mm -hmm. I respect that. So if Garillo is similar, yeah. then I, I'll probably like. Him. You want Garillo with a shirt on or with abs? With a shirt on, mm -hmm. always. Well, you know, he shows his abs anyway, but. This one is more like classic. It's Nobody like wants to see Goryu. Keep it, no, keep it under I'm wraps. I'm sure a lot of people want to see his abs. Him and Garam Barrels have a pretty body. Well, I ain't down with that. <laughs> I didn't even get to know them or anything. Are they gonna talk? No. Okay. Also, so these guys are also not. Guriyu and Claude could become great friends and go together to the hair salon because he too is in desperate need of a haircut. Do I get double Oage san for this? How come? How come she's not great? But yeah, on his uh, picture there, he does seem very pleased with himself. Guriyu? Yeah. 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 Are those the best characters? No. Are they characters I want to use? Yes. Why do you insist? Alright, so okay, I'm gonna go fight this guy. I'm gonna explore a little bit. Like, so I guess they're not fire like they're not weak to fire, they're weak to win. They're not weak to anything, Jesus. Oh they're um they're probably strong to my incompetent, because I am incompetent. So yeah, so well, I how guess. How do we figure out? But it they're, says they're, weak. It says weak to win, I guess, whatever. I'll be the bar. Okay, I will. My goodness. That barely made a dent. Are we like not strong enough to be here? No, no, no. I'm strong enough to be here, okay? This is nothing nothing to worry about. Everything is going everything is going great, okay? Everything is going great. Everything is under control. Okay? Okay, I can see you have a healer now. Of course, Aicha. I might, I might need to switch for like a more win-based uh, team. Well, yeah, I strongly suggest you just, you know, yeah. do what works. So lots of uh, debuffs too. Yes. Yeah. That seems helpful. It Who's is. Doing the, um, the everybody, debuff? everybody has like, okay. um, yeah. Maggots. Mm -hmm. That's for you. Yeah. Good. Right. <laughs> All right. So I'm gonna I'm gonna use I'm gonna use a win team now. Seems to be a. It seems to be like what the game wants me to do. It seems to be a difficult zone. Well, it, it is. It is. It is a later zone. So let me uh, let me use a win team composition here. I'm not gonna use Melissa. I'm gonna use Kiriko. And I'm not gonna use Aisha. I'm gonna well, use. Well, the healing was very useful. Yeah. I'm gonna use a. Uh, I'm gonna use a. Uh, some other girl. I'm gonna use Suzette for the for the win zone. There you go, a team without, you know, with, without any um, synergy, but a cool team nonetheless. 
man. Just, just, just because the game's gonna prove me wrong, I'm gonna get my ass kicked by the next fight. Oh, you did say your team had no synergy. Mm -hmm. So if you knew that. Here. I like Kiriko. He's cool. Kikyo. Kikyo. He also has a motorcycle, which is which is cool too. Right here. Okay. Feels really like last castle from a game, right? You mean the music? Yeah. Not memorable Don't enough. It's a good track, don't get me wrong. Take this! Okay, well that'll work. Mm -hmm. But I'll listen to it some more. See what I think. But I see, I see what you mean with the vibe. Yeah. Alright, let's see that monster. Tritos. But they have more memorable tracks, such as Rattle. The best one. Nah. Okay. Suzette, Suzette's gonna go kill everything. Yeah, 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 yeah. Suzette hits like a truck. See that? That's all the numbers. All right. Well, they don't—they don't speak much at the end. Mm. I'm probably gonna get back here without. Um, when I'm not doing the main quest, I can like you know get all the stone, like all the chests. Ooh. Yeah, see, we're, we're kind of like climbing the last tower. Disturbers of Kelkel's fun. Overcome the washing, waiting, wasting, wasting cycle. No? Okay. The skies grow dark. Yeah. Well, you like floating islands. I sure do. You like floating islands? Yes, I do. Uh, they're one of my favorite things. Huh. Oh, okay. Giving me ideas now that I'm gonna write young adult fiction. Ah, you're gonna write another Eden fan fiction? No, I, I want to. I want to write like an original story. Ah. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh. Okay. I guess. Uh, I guess he wanted to run. All right. even any good? She's alright. It's just that she's kind of weak because she's only a 4 star, right? Oh god. But she also- ooh, okay, yeah, no. I was like, oh, I was about to say she also has, like decent- have a, she has decent um, capability of uh, to defend herself, but you know, that, that proved me wrong when I died there. So, uh, am I gonna lose again? Yeah. <laughs> okay, good. Oh, you're all good. Yeah. Take this. I I don't know why I'm playing like garbage today. I guess I could just use Melissa and clear everything. But no. I like Melissa. I yeah. play I play with Melissa quite yeah. a bit. Well, uh, this this was all on purpose, guys. I needed to um, I needed to uh, fill up my AF bar, so you know this was yeah, yeah it was like, a task. Teteratos. You time. were just checking if we were paying attention. Ex exactly. That, that is that that was exactly it. Hey, 
That's very good. Also, yeah, uh, not Melissa, but Suzette, like, she's really good once she gets her first uh, her first well, attack like, in. I don't even know who it was, Melissa, but... Uh, that's uh, Suzette. Suzette. The character like, that did the whole bar? Suzette. Hits like a truck, but she, you, need, you need to do that other move first. She needs yeah, a yeah. zone... She needs wins. Yeah. Well, the previous style, too, you had to do, like... A, Exquisite blossom or yeah. whatever, and then I, elegant cavort. I think I think it was called See? exquisite. This yeah. yeah. of Kel Kel. I remember because I used her. Overcome the consume circle. Okay. I also, I also like uh, Suzette from Hot Topic. The one that looks like a uh, she's from Hot Topic. The original Suzette. No 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 the one with um she has like a white dress and two hammers. Oh. I don't back down. Well, fun fact, I don't like any of her designs, but I like her as a character and I use her all the time. Really? Yeah, it's the proof that you really don't need to like a character's character design to, um, you know, enjoy playing them, right? I mean, my World of Warcraft character is extremely unattractive, and yet, I love her the most of all characters. And it's not because I like the design of her, you know, uh, Bermudas showing the knees. Mm. You play on you play an undead for correct, correct. For everyone out there asking, she plays an undead in World of Warcraft. Two now. Mm. I don't extinguish that easy. I like her. She's so badass. All right, what do I get with the primal? You could dispel the consumed circle. Okay, where is it? Ha! Ah, it's over there. There's often these like small elements in the decor that you're like, oh my god, so cool. Like what? Like outside this room, and, uh, there was like a vase of flowers that was pretty cool. Ah! A link to the first floor has been established. That's cool. So I can't like, unlock that. All so right. this place is gonna be like a giant puzzle, right? Um, no, I think I just need to go up there. It is the king's duty to lead the way. I should have done that. Bullseye. I don't extinguish that easy. I know you don't. Good for you. All right, what's the name of this guy? Trial Guardian. Hindrance, okay. Ooh, no. Oh no. Uh, it's gonna, wow, it's gonna be nothing's fine. Nothing's going on. It's gonna be fine. I'll be fine. Unless he heals. Yeah, no! <laughs> Famous last word. I'll be fine. Yeah, no, oh, he heals too. Yeah. Both. Oh, time to die. Well, famous. Oh, you know what? Okay, so he is strong. I, I, I guess there's nothing else we need to do. Come on, kill me. Kill me! Alright, yeah, it's not... She can't die every time she does her first attack because... Uh, that's part of her power? Yeah, it's part of, part of her power, yeah. Dun dun... All right, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say quit. I'm gonna go back to the main menu, so and I'm actually gonna, you know what? I'm actually gonna so play for real now. <sighs> so.
No. Let's, let's just let's just do that for now. There you go. All right, I'm gonna go. All right. All right. Let's uh let's make it work this time, right? Do, do you believe in me? Um. Are you doing the same thing? No, you just changed one character. I changed a couple of characters actually. I suppose I do believe in you. Mm, good. Cause I, I know they're weak to wins. I need to, uh, I need, I need to do stuff. I don't know what. Okay. Well, now you're making it very hard to believe in you, yeah. with that kind of, uh, you know. Flip the floor. If that's your pitch. <laughs> no, no, my pitch is. Um, you I'm, don't sound so sure yourself. My pitch is I'm decent at this game when no one is watching, right? This is where I'm best at everything. I know, right? I'm actually gonna go. Oh my god! Is my, is my S bar up? No, but it's okay. I don't. I don't need it. You 100% need to be no, doing it. No, 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 no. You'll see. You'll see. Wow. Okay. So she 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 should be back. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> Take this. There you go. I'm just gonna spam him just because he annoyed me. And because why not? Yeah, there you I go. like to overkill as much as I possibly can. Take that, you s useless. There you go. Alright, I add some rage in me. None of you guys speak? Okay. Alright, let's go here. Towers of Selection 64. Okay. Now there's a bus, I'm kind of fucked, but you know. Oh, cool. We can actually voice. It's so pretty. I know. Oh, a major trials await you beyond this point. Proceed. Yes. Uh, with the opposite <laughs> of haste, with hesitation. You did well to get here. I am Kel Kel, the Kingmaker. You have shown great wisdom and benevolence in the trial. I see. So the battle's up to now. Where to? Uh, th so the battle's up to now. Where determine my strength to test my wisdom, and the final test will be to defeat you by force. Oh, it's the dinosaur again. Indeed, I give you the opportunity for redemption. Shoot me down, O oh master of the royal bow. Oh, okay. All right, a bunch of buff and debuff. All right, so what I'm gonna do is this chivalry. Give me some speed, and then she's gonna do mm, this. So what I do is I make sure that everyone targets, uh, everyone's target the girl, so she doesn't die. And in the meantime, I'm free to do whatever I want. Also, he doesn't seem to be healing, which is fine. Oh, never mind. Famous last word again. I'm good. I'm good. Hey. <laughs> Have you seen that? Oh. Have you seen that, that amount of damage? Holy moly. Yeah, no, she's super strong. She just needs some setup. She just needs some setup. Incredible! 
You have you, Mr. proved Dinosaur. yourself as king. You shall be free from some of the shackle that constrain you. I feel it. My magic is so much stronger than before. Child of men, child of the sinner, use well the hot blood flowing through your veins. Is it over? Now we just need to make sure the levitation ritual works. Claude, what's wrong? Oh, 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 nothing. Just something on my mind. Hmm. Okay, let's go back to King Claudius and tell him I have proved myself as king. Hey, look, it's her boyfriend. You're back. I am. I'm successfully proven myself unworthy. <laughs> A torrent of magic now flows through my body. I will be able to aid you in the rising. I'm sure, yes. Please, do all you can for our people. The Rising Ritual takes place tomorrow. Until then, rest up. That's the dinosaur. Oh. What's wrong, Claudio? The Rising is much more likely to work now. You should be happy. Yeah, he sounds depressed, for yeah. sure. I am happy. Of course, I am. We haven't seen Phantom yet. My only wish is to protect my country and my people. He who looks so like my brother is sure to save them. He feels inadequate. Mm. He's so much stronger than I. Oh, he was the youngest brother mm. who wasn't meant to be king. Yeah. <gasps> the Rising! Something wrong? We never found out what the distortion was in the end. Even if the ritual works, if we fail to correct the distortion, time may still reverse again. This whole thing could have been a complete waste of our time. Um, I know I'm worried about it too, but we don't have any other leads, so, you know. If history says Calcale perishes anyway, then ritual failing can't be what causes time to reverse. I have my doubts, but I must do it. This is why we came all the way, all this way. Exactly, right now, we have to believe that our action will push things in the right direction. We did what we could. I'm sure it'll be okay. We changed the past like every place else, guys. Yeah, but we haven't seen Phantom yet. Like, we saved the Grandpapa, we... Made it so that the fortress wasn't like sacked and whatever. We so surely we can save Kelkale. We created life with uh, alchemy. C correct, correct, yes. Um, you yeah, know, we we did we did a bunch of cool stuff, but they don't really count because it's not the same episode. So, um, yeah. You know what? Let's let's do a side quest. Let's do a little side quest here. In the meantime, we're right next to it, right? We're right next to it. It tells to the future. While walking to the palace, Claude consume in thought pauses. Also, I need the stone. I picture the king as more distant and standoffish. But Claudio is really easy to talk to, huh? Yeah, and he's really friendly too. You met God, Aldo. Come on. Hmm. Claude, what's up? <gasps> Show more respect. Huh? What? What? What's that? Wait, have we... Are you mad at us, Claude? I guess we have been pretty casual talking about the king and of your whole country. And he's like your ancestor? Um, honored ancestor too? I don't know. I'm sorry if it upset you. 
What is this, like a petal? However, whoever left this book here needs to show more respect. Huh. A book? Books are delicate and require precise caretaking. Not only dust and bookworms, but even humidity, the heat, are the enemy of preservation. Books ought, ought to, be ply, to be placed with enough space to breathe, but not enough to land or otherwise destroy. Direct light can contribute to fading and it's best avoided. After all, a paper book is an incredibly delicate object. Oh, um, yes. Yeah, so passionate. Yeah, sure, dude. Yep. Who could have left this here? Hmm. There's no name written in it. There's a man with a bow uh, and a dragon on fire on the cover. Is it an adventure story, maybe? It's called, let's see, The Dragon That Swallowed the Sun. That's pretty intense for a short story. Hollow, you can't even read. Hmm. Most likely this is. Ah, uh, there it is. It's probably a Let's kid. See? Ah, yes. Ha, huh, thank goodness. I worried I'd lost it. I see. So this book is yours. I am pleased to see that you appear to be a book lover. But you have to make... To take more care with the things you love. Of course. It's just as you said. When I got back to the store... And Sai was missing a volume, but blood ran cold. Um, I'm glad you found it again. Yay. Thank you. Now, I just need to find the rest. Wait, you're missing more? I am the royal librarian. I am the royal library. It's librarian. We, we're evacuating books from libraries. It's Pollute's district to safer location for storage. Books are a type of bond, you see, from the past to the present. And even to the future. It's just, there are so many to carry, and it seems to have dropped a few. Aww. I appreciate your passion for books, and for the power of they hold. These seas of wisdom require rescue, and I, a lover of the written words, shall not deny them my help. I love you so much, Claude. Yeah, right, more pairs of eyes will help the search go faster. Thank you so much. Let's put up and search inside the palace, shall we? If you find any books, bring them right here. We'll collect them. Yay, a quest. I, a lover of the written word. A man after my own heart. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. There's probably one here. Secret of the Royal Kitchen, as told by a royal chef of 20 years. A curious title. Is it a cookbook? No way, that's a library book. Ah, I see you do not fully grasp the purpose of a library, Aldo. Of course not, you cannot read. <laughs> a library is a font of wisdom from all sources bearing none. All books are worthy of its shelf. You may have no use for it yourself, but to humanity as a whole, all book holds some value imaginable. Um, oh, I see. Books are really something. I mean, he did say that he, he never read a book, right? He says he doesn't like to do it. I like. I like to imagine that Aldo cannot read. He can. He just did. There's one down there. See, here he is doing it again. Saint Casimir and the Dragon. Kelka sure does love its dragon. So much so that the, the funda fundating myth involved the slaying of the wicked dragons, yes. The founders, it says, to have been bathed in the dragon's blood, and his royal line has cured the blood since. Does that mean you have dragon blood in your veins? Naturally, all kingdoms by definition are ruler by a royal Leon, but only Kalkia's ruler are so glorious. Amazing how you said that without even a single blush. Yeah. He's completely unashamed and I as know. he should. I am a proud of my bloodline. I will never be See? ashamed of it. See? Yeah. He and I we understand each other. You should you should you should cosplay him. <laughs> you should you should cosplay Claude. Well with this beautiful ladylike luscious hair, yeah. I'm sure I'd be a very uh like a shampoo ad. Yeah. Hey. Isn't this one?
Hmm. There appears to be a magical code struck to it. A magical code? A method of storing text and numbers as visual data, commonly used in re record keeping and inventory. This one specifically mentioned the Kels Kels Rare Library. This is one of these books we are seeking. That's most of the palace is discovered. Yes, let us reconvene with the good man from before and return to him the book we found. He said to meet up where we ran into him before, right? Let's go. Typical JRPG fetch quest, right? Am I right? Am I right? Yeah. People? I mean, I, I enjoy those quests as much as the next guy. Ha! Oh, welcome back. I get, how did it go? I found the two last book myself. We look at it three. Is that all just lost his book? It is. Thank goodness we found them all. How can I possibly thank you? We need no thanks. I could not leave a fellow book lover in such a conundrum. No, that just won't do it. I know, since you love books, I'll give you this one. Oh. More book for his Wikipedia article. That's right, that's right. <laughs> the Dragon That Swallowed the Sun. It's the very first book we found. Are you sure we can have this? Yes. Oh, sorry. Yes, I found it. I found an additional copy just a little while ago. And the stock of the palace aren't as spacious as a real library, so we have no space for a duplicate. I would hate to dispose of it, so please, take it. It's yours. If you insist, I will gladly accept it. I shall have a place of honor under my bed in the Kels Kels collection. After all the talk about how books are delicate, you're not going to put it in the bookshelf? Hmm. My castle is limited in the floor space. There's nowhere to put a bookshelf. He lives in a shady apartment. Must be pretty cramped. They may not rest upon a decorate shelf, but I take the greatest care of each of my books. I shall not suffer even the smallest dog here under my watch. I don't, I don't, don't know what that means. <laughs> I, could, I couldn't be happier to hear that. When more copies store in different places, the chance of this story surviving in the future only grows. I'm glad you asked, librarian. I am the curator for the wiki. <laughs> I promise you, no matter what may come, this volume at last, shall survive to see it. He's kind of like the Bammy of another Eden. He's, he's the guy who holds uh, the Discord yeah. and the Wiki. Yeah. It's now carries with, uh, with, with is all that I have gained from meeting with the fellow book lover after all. Alright, one more quest. One more main quest and then we'll call it a day. Oh. What is, what's going on? I think doing side quests is like helping him. Oh. Yeah, see, oh. you're getting another blessing. Oh. Because the more quests you do, the more trials you can do because you're being benevolent to your people. Ah, okay. So should I do one more side quest and then we'll call it a day? If that's, uh, yeah, sure, why not? I mean, cause yeah, I wanna do, I wanna do all the side quests now, guys. I wanna do all the side quests, I can, you know, be fun. Because, you know, I want all the things. The kings of Nevermore, their choice. A man studied the philosophy of monsters in the unclean land. It seems he's short of his research material. Ah, your favorite type of quest. Killing shit. <laughs> you want to do him? Not enough. Not enough. There are nowhere near enough samples for my research. You certainly are making a ruckus. What appears to be the problem? Oh, um, I'm studying the monsters of the unclean lands, but I've run out of samples for testing. You're studying the monster? But what for? I'm studying how life has changed within the polluted regions of the unclean lands. If we can learn how they survive through those toxins, Maybe we can apply it to humans, too. 
A fascinating concept. Should I procure more sample for you then? Would you? That would be great. I need more samples from monsters written on this list. Thanks in advance. Quest accepted, my friend. Nona didn't, didn't say a word in that scene, but she was there. She yeah. Was there. All right. So, um, yeah, where's... Okay, so I need, I need to go to the, uh, the polluted zone. Ah, the land of the Nuntly. With my favorite song in the game. <laughs> They sure like to reuse it. I freaking hate that song so bad. There can be only one. Ha! Take this! Ah, oh, come on! I don't extinguish that easy. At least we can hear what her voice sounds like. Yeah, for sure. We should we should do our quest. I want to do our. our like, I I I don't know who she is. Like in uh, um, like in our quest, we also should do a Philomelifus. Never did her. According to the, according to the research, is no. This should be the right place. Oh. Ah, there it comes. It saves us the trouble of searching for ourselves. Agreed. Yeah. Don't get in the Blow way of my birds. work. Cool design, not gonna lie, cool design. It's pretty, it's pretty, it's pretty neat. I think they're gonna die easily. No. Oh. oh. Yes. yes. I don't extinguish that easy. Simple, simple. Got it. We just need one more type. Huh, not bad. I know, right? Man, I freaking hate this song so bad. It's just, it's, it's a bit overused. Yeah. But... It's because it, it sounds like crying trumpet. And, and he, it's not bad in this zone, in like a sad, polluted zone. But sometimes it shows up just because like there's a strange character yeah. coming and whatever. And like it, it doesn't do so well as like a suspense mm -hmm. type music. Hmm, I don't see anything. Oh, it's a rhinoceros. Whoa! But with crystal. It's because the devil, right as they say. Crystal pr rhino. Mm. Who would have thought? At some point, I don't expect an original name for every creature in a game that lasts forever. Yeah, well. There, that's all the simple. Hmm, Claude is. Hmm, Claude is thinking. It's pensive. You don't look happy. What's wrong? Mm, nothing. Pay me no mind. Let us return. Any needs over. Oh, I'm afraid that's impossible, Claude. Your light shines through. You're too handsome for me. I don't know. I don't know that I would qualify him as handsome, but he's charismatic. He's got it. He just has this. The his conviction is what's very charming. Uh, cool with, about him. Want to go with charming? Yeah, we'll add it. We'll do. We'll do the last one. We'll add it. So all of them are going to be complete. And then next time, we can continue the main quest. Mm -hmm. There's also three kids that probably needs my help too. Alright, gonna get some more quests. Thank you. I should be able to finish my analysis in no time with these samples. I would be interested in seeing the result of your analysis. May I? Of course. Just give me a little while.
Hmm. What's wrong? We didn't take samples from the wrong monsters, did we? No. The analysis finished, but no noticeable issues. But the results show, show no significant differences between unclean lands monsters and those from outside. No difference? Then they were just always just strong against pollution? Sorry, I misspoke. There's no difference in their overall body structure, but their nervous systems are very different. What does it mean? I had hypothesized that these monsters had evolved to better suit highly toxic in, uh, in environments. Probably environment? Yeah. But they didn't evolve to suit it. They just lost their sense of pain. I had wondered why all the monsters we faced died with almost peaceful expression upon their faces. Oh god, that's oh, very dramatic. Oh Jesus Christ, okay. Their bodies are just as ravaged by pollution as any other organism. They just can't feel it. Needless to say, this research holds no use for humans at all. I'm sorry you had to face such danger out there. All for such pointless results as these. Both you and the monsters are searching fervently and for a way to survive in this ruined world. I feel nothing but the deepest respect for both of you. The will to live is the most precious drive in life. Go Claude. Wise to boot. Yeah, but I'm kind of depressed now. I mean, the monsters are suffering. Alright, one more ball. And then one more quest. Yeah. Yeah, I guess I'm gonna need to pull, put those into the um the, the chandeliers or whatever, and it's gonna open up some pat. Yeah, absolutely. All right. They did explain it to us. I know. All right, last quest of the day. I want to also want to do the the big the big one here, but we'll do this one. Oh, hello. Guardian of Kelkel, one of the palace cleaners, asked Aldo if he could take a man's place for a day. Oh, this is gonna be funny. I like I like quests that are funny. You wanna do the janitor? No. Okay. Excuse me, good people. Could I have a moment with you? Sure. What's going on? Ah, I heard talk about vis visitors who will help anyone in need with any problem. Is that you? Well, I mean, I guess it's. I guess it's not wrong, but oh well, I mean, yeah, it's us, it's, it's me, Aldo. Yeah. You see, I'm part of the palace janitorial staff. A Senate matter comes up, and I can't work today. So, what I wanted to ask, could you possibly sub for me, just a little while? I would never turn down a request from one of Kalskel's children, and I'm rather skills at cleaning. I bet. Really? That's, that's actually not that surprising. You seem like you're good at just about everything. In the student's hostel, we must manage all of her personal effects and hygiene herself. And anything worth doing is worth taking the time to learn it to do it well. So, you'll just do it? Thank you. I'll hurry back as soon as I can. Just settle these sectors, please. You got a massive broom. Whoa, it's so heavy. Do you suppose he was, talk he was taking the chance to get in some daily strength training alongside of his work? I doubt it. This thing's weighed as much as a decent heavy war axe. As he managed to clean with this, who even is this guy? He seems suspicious. I don't know. I we'll don't, see. I know. Let's go clean some stuff. All right. So what do we... Uh, come on, Aldo. Shh. Be the janitor. Claude is on the case. All clean over here. Good work. Just have a little bit to the left here. All right. Your broom is really unusual, Aldo. It's super heavy, right? And the shape is all weird too. 
kind of feels like a broom's head where just hardly is stuck into it at the end of some some strange other tool. Strange, oh no. Ha! What are you doing running around with the boss's broom? He says he has something to do, so he asked me to fill in for him for a little while today. You call him boss, right? Do you know him well? He was our instructor. He's super strong. Enough metal to make a whole suit of armor with. He was even given a legendary spear from the royal treasury as proof of his heroism. It's yeah. The broom. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wow, that's really impressive. It's kind of like those Chinese uh, spear. You know, with the... It can be. That there's no way this broom could be, right? No way. Oops, I'd rather get back to my post. Or my partner would give us the real earful. Say hi to the boss for me. We will. Okay, almost done here. Hmm. I heard the cleaners were here, but I don't see the old guy anywhere. If you mean the older Jenner, he had an errand to run. Hmm. And here I was hoping to chat with him a little. Are you two friends? Of course. He saved my life. You see, all the sparkly dust there, it's dangerous, bad stuff. When I was little, I thought it was stardust, so I played with it, and a piece stuck into my hand. I was really close. I almost died before he found me. Really? Whoa, he's a real hero, huh? I mean, if he's a hero, why does he need to, uh... Maybe he wants to. Why does he need to trick Aldo into doing his work? Maybe he thinks that that's the best way to help the people of Kelkale in these hard times. Now that there aren't any wars to be fought, and just the bad, you know, unclean stuff. We'll see. Ah, and trash secure. You know, I'm expecting it to be just a regular dust and grime, but it's all sparkly like Tiny Jewel. Hey, you there, don't touch that. It may look pretty, but it's actually deadly toxic. Toxic? Why would it be toxic materials in the, inside the, the real palace? It falls down from above. The palace is a magical barrier that protects it from polluents like monster attacks and monster attacks. But sometimes, the pollution binds to magic residue and precipitates down as, as the sparkling dust. It's real pretty. So, we have to make sure the children know it's bad. It used to make lots of kids sick. I see. Thank you for telling us. Hmm. Now that we know that, we ought to re redouble our effort. Yeah, he's doing it to help the kids. That's why he's doing it, the janitor. No, no, I know, but like, why the, j the janitor needs a break? Oh, we'll see. All set over here. It's practically sparkling. Indeed, not a boat of dust left. We've done some fine work here, as I do say so myself. You're really particular when it comes to cleaning. You have to be. Anything is worth doing is worth learning to do it well, I say. Now, let us return to the janitors and make a report. Claude would be the best person to live with. Yeah. Be more like Claude. I'll be more like Aldo instead. Yikes. Ha! Huh. There you are. Thank ex thanks again for helping me. It was a scan a few hours. No need to thank us. We ran into several people who told us some surprising things about you. You used to be a famous knight, right? We made you. Uh, what made you want to become a janitor? There was an incident where a little girl was serious, seriously hurt by the pollution fallout, you see. She had been playing with the dust, and when she clapped, a shard struck into her palm. 
given how toxic it is, she had she was in really bad shape. Thankfully, the doctor were able to make sure the worst didn't happen, but it was a big shock to me, even so. Yeah, it would be really I would be really scared to learn something that's all over the place was so dangerous. See, it's the best way to help the people. I was right. So, when my last cohort of trainees finished it up, I quit, made myself a broom, and got to cl I got to do cleaning. So, that weird broom was handmade after all. A lot of people say that uh, it's thanks to you that they feel safe here in the palace. You truly are the guardian of the palace, nah, of Kalkel -Kal itself. Oh, please. I'm just a humble janitor. But I'll do my best to keep protecting this place with everything I have in me. Good man, please do. We haven't learned what, what he had to do today. Oh, maybe he was just busy. Okay. Maybe it was unimportant. <laughs> oh, a new, a new stone. Look at that. Beautiful, isn't it? Yes. From Marvel Blessing. All right. Well, guys. I think that's gonna conclude today. Um, yeah, voice the, acting quests. The side quests were cute. Yeah. More Claude time. More Claude time indeed. I think we're gonna keep that party for ladies and I enjoy. And also, they also kick ass, so, you know. Cool. At least I'm not gonna die. Uh, Alright, guys, that being said, please leave a comment of how you like the quests and make sure that you like and subscribe to our channel. We would really appreciate it, guys. You bet. And we'll see you guys next <laughs> time for more Another Eden. Bye. Bye-bye.